Hey everyone, hello and welcome back to Pun It. This is the competitive wordplay game show podcast. I'm your host, Tom Quee. It is great to be back. If you're not familiar with Pun It, basically we're sort of weaponizing wordplay, I suppose, into a sort of free contest and free for all. You know, each of the guys today have been given two sets of two disparate punning categories to draw from. And in round one, that's going to be Leonardo DiCaprio films and English cities. And round two being football players and notorious B.I.G. songs. But rather than sort of go through the rules, it's easier just to play it. You know, I'm sure you'll you'll pick it up. You'll get a feel for it. And just before we get to our guests and our puns, of course, be sure to subscribe to this channel. Uh, you can contact us at thepunpodcast at gmail.com. If you've got any puns for any categories we've came up with, if you've got any suggestions, if you indeed want to come on and compete on the show, like the three guys sitting here did, you know, it's weird, really. Pun it is a very odd, confounding game, but somehow it's survived through the confines of my sixth form common room. And now people all around the world like to play it on a, uh, on a Monday evening. So yeah, get in touch with me there, thepunpodcast at gmail.com. We have a Patreon as well. We are a week ahead of the main schedule. So if you just can't get enough upon it, you want to give back to upon it, you can uh, subscribe over on there. And also you get access to the Discord and loads of other goodies. So yeah, all the links down below, um, the pun podcast at gmail.com, as I say, on Twitter, iTunes, RSS feeds, wherever they take you, you'll probably find us. So um, so yeah, we are on to our guests today. And uh, you know we've got three returning guests. And I'm going to introduce him first of all. He's had free appearance on the show. Fellow fellow Brummy, Will, how's it going? All good, man. How are you? I'm I'm very well. And like, is it fair to say you have a little leg up on the competition because you are kind of a legendary UK battle rapper? <laughs> <laughs> I think that's a very generous fair, way of putting it, but I appreciate it. Um, yeah, had a couple, have a couple times on this. I think I've been on near enough every podcast you've ever launched. <laughs> I think you. Apart from the metallic one, that's yeah. not my bag, but yeah. <laughs> yes, you're very dependable. It's great to have you. And um, Barry, how's it going? Hi, uh, good man. Uh, I'm, uh, I'm uh, standing up for the poets here in the in the pun game. I, uh, you know, get getting stuck into these battle rappers. <laughs> <laughs> I, you know, that that this is what's beautiful about pun it really. It brings together all that. You know that meme where there's all the swords kind of connecting over one issue. I feel like we all <laughs> unite over puns. So. Uh, it's great to have you. And Oz, only been on the one time, but it was a great episode, and I'm really happy to have you back. Yes, glad to, glad to be back, and glad the show is back as well. So thank you. Yes, yes, yes. So um, as I said before, this has kind of been a you know 2024 kick, really, to bring the show back. There aren't many changes. Um, there's a few that I just outlined with the guys. So we aren't going to expand the third round, the freestyle third round. So yeah, the structure of the show, the first round and the second round are the same. The guys have been given two sets of categories to pun with. And we are going to go round. And the order we're going to go round in round one is Barry, Osman, and Will. And, you know, I'm very, very excited to hear <laughs> what you guys, you guys came up with for Leonardo DiCaprio films and you and that's English cities. Sorry, English cities. And let's just explore those categories a bit more. So with Leo Films, I believe he starred in about 38 films, debuting in 1991. And in terms of cities in England, there are 51, I believe. So um, there's lots to choose from here. Barry, can you kick us off, please, with Leonardo DiCaprio Films and English Cities? I'm going to kick off with Catch Me If You Can't to Bury. Yeah, Catch Me If You Can't to Bury, sure. And Oz, please. Uh, I'll go with um, the Bath Goodball Diaries. <laughs> <laughs> nice. That is a yeah, great <laughs> film and a great pun. And Will, I'm going to go with What's He in Guildford Grape? Wow, that is this is yeah, that's difficult. Um, it's Bath at a, a push, oh. a very tight push. But I'll give Oz the uh, first point there. Barry, what's your second, please? I'm going to, uh, I think I'm going to go with the Wolverhampton of Wall Street. Yeah, Wolverhampton of Wall Street. <laughs> um, Oz? Uh, this, might, this might be cheating slightly, but I'm going to go with uh, the Manny in the Iron Mask. The, the Manny, sorry. Is that yeah, it? the Manny in the Iron Mask. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I see. And uh, uh, quite a fall from grace from the first round. And Will, please. The Revenant Twitch. <laughs> Um, I like Nantwich. Yeah, I do like Nantwich. So I'm going to go there. Um, 
Barry, third round, please. Oh, sorry, the third pun of this round. So tune into my American accent here. We're mm-hmm. going with Body of Leicester. Lice, yeah, yeah. Famously, horrifically, yeah, on that like, G-Regs type, like, tick, yeah. Um, okay, Osman, please. Uh, Shutter Carl Island. Sure, sure, yeah, Shutter Carl Island. Uh, Will? I'll go, don't look up, Minster. Don't look up, Minster. Uh, nothing amazing there, really. Uh, don't look up, Minster, I guess, but wow. Maybe this maybe this was different, more difficult than I thought. So, um, uh, Barry, your fourth, please. Uh, catching the Sunderland. Catching the Sunderland, yeah, yeah. Uh, we're, we're spanning his, his his filmography quite well here. Uh, Osmond. Um, before the Brad Flood. <laughs> before the Brad Flood, yeah. And Will, please. Gangs of New Yorkshire. Gangs of New Yorkshire. Will just keeps coming in with his cheeky little puns that I quite like. So I will give uh, I will give Will the point there. And, but it's uh, a York, York, Yorkshire's more of a county. Though, huh? That's true, actually. <laughs> that's true. Ge- geographically, that's unsound, Will. So you know, I'm uh, I'm I'm not really pleased with that. I'll I will go for um before the Brad flood. Was that the one that you had, Osman? Yeah. Okay, we'll go there. And um, Barry, your final, please. Oh, I've I've struggled with this round, so I've. Uh, it's Manchester and the Iron Mask. This was my final one. Okay, it didn't get much love the variant before, but no. Uh, and uh, Osman, um, the the eleventh hour, the, ha- the ha- yeah, the eleventh hour. hour. I see. Sorry, yeah, I didn't quite catch it. And Will, uh, the only one that's not been said. The film's been used before, but a different place. I use Catch Me If You Can. Mm. Catch me if you can. I mean, on a pure sort of technicality, I will give Osmond the point there. So Osmond, we're free. I mean, that was uh, that That's was a bloody somehow. category, right? There was no real glory there. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a warm up round. It's yeah, just a warm up round. Exactly. So um, Osmond is leading at three. Will's at two. Barry's at zero. But but again, guys, like you know, with these categories, because I've been on this big hype bringing the show back, and I've just been like thinking of all the categories I possibly can. I haven't really been doing the testing. So maybe that is my foolhardy approach there. But still, we saw we didn't even actually get a full 15 there. There were some repetitions. There were some some misnomers. So um, we move on anyway. Hopefully, this will be, you know, far wider for you in round two because we are talking about football players and notorious B.I.G. songs. And again, let's just explode that. So uh, Biggie is one of my personal all-time favorite rappers. I think Ready to Die is, it, yeah, it's my favorite hip-hop album ever. And, you know, as we all know, there is a real, unfortunately, small amount of Biggie songs. Um, You know, they're all classics, pretty much. They're all indispensable in their own way because of the context. So I wanted to compensate that by blowing it wide open with the football players, soccer players category. So this is this is probably too big, uh, but it's any league, any nation, any era, you know, any position, whatever. And how are you going to pun? football players with Notorious B.I.G. songs. Will, kick us off, please. So glad I got to go first. My favourite one, absolute tap-in, Thomas Party and Bullshit. Tom, yeah, 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 Thomas Party and Bullshit. <laughs> Great single. Um, Barry? Who shot Yaya Toure? <laughs> Who shot Yaya Toure, yeah. And Osmond, please. Mo Mane, Mo Problems. Wow, this is... Uh... I think it is the party there. I think it's just too clean. But I'm going to just have to give uh, give Will the point there. So, um, Will, your second, please. I've got Eric Ten Hag Crack Commandments. Eric Ten Hag Crack Commandments. So ten Crack Commandments. And yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure, sure. Um, okay. I wasn't sure yeah, I mean... the hag at the end or in the middle, but yeah, could yeah, have been Ten Crack Commandments. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Roll off. Um, <laughs> Ba- Barry, please. Yeah. I'm going to Steve Unbelievable. Sure, sure. Steve, Steve Un- Bull. Steve Bull, yeah, Steve and Bull. Unbelievable. Yeah, 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 unbelievable, yeah. Uh, Biggie Smalls is the illest, as, as we know. Um, Osman. Ings done changed. Ings done changed. That's fantastic. Yeah, the uh, I'm, I'm going to give you the point for that. I think it's quite obvious how I feel about that. Uh, Ings done changed. Danny Ings, of course, and it's the uh, 
Well, it is the opener to Ready to Die. It's the first song, as it were. Um, and Will, please. Nasty Sitch Girl. Nasty Sitch Girl, yeah. Nasty Sitch Girl. My guy likes the non-album tracks. Uh, Barry. Going back to Carly Dixon. <laughs> <laughs> back to Carly Dixon, yeah, that's great. And Osman. Uh, so this song has been done, but I'm going to go with uh, Unsalibable. Yeah, yeah. It's it's back to Cali Dixon. I mean, I wanted to give Barry a point anyway. Uh, <laughs> Sympathy point. <laughs> it is good. It is good. Um, so Will, Will with the fourth, please. Sammy Hypnotize. Can you say that again, sorry? The first bit? Sammy Hypnotize. Sammy Hypnotize. But- that's... It's clumsy for, for me there, Will. Um, Barry? This is a, not quite a track. It's a track on one of the albums, not mm. necessarily a song. So we're going B.I.G. Inter Ludo Modric. I mean, you've just sort of taken interlude there, but yeah, Inter Ludo Modric, sure, the, uh, the playmaker. And Osman? Machine Gun Dunk. Machine Gun Dunk? Who's Dunk, sorry? Uh, Lewis Dunk. Brighton. Lewis Dunk, yeah, not a football fanatic here, but um, oh, fair enough. Uh, it's it's Dunk. I'm going to give Dunk the point there. So Oz Oz is at five currently. Will's at two. Barry's at one. Um, Will, your final please for football players and notorious Big songs. Um, what have I got left? Ready to D D Haman. Wow. wow. Okay. Uh, <laughs> you've been impressed with the last few. Yeah, yeah, the scraping that I'm hearing right now, the bucket, is deafening, <laughs> absolutely deafening. Um, I thought this was going to be easy. Uh, where's Ronaldo's? Where's the message? Barry, please, with your final player here, Terry Henry. Okay, yeah, yeah, play here, Terry. <laughs> it's fun to say. It's fun to try to say. <laughs> um, Osman. Again, this this might be slight cheating, but uh, I had suicidal thoughts. Right. So, <laughs> uh, again, again, not not an amazing showing, gentlemen. I'm afraid I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to be tough here. It, it might be time for some uh, hair dry treatment, but I don't even do I even want to give a point to any of these really. Um, I like suicidal thoughts. I know it's not a player, but it's 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 good. <laughs> yeah, I suppose so. I suppose so. But I asked for players, um, <laughs> so no points are awarded on that round. No points. Oh. It's a whole new a whole new punnet season. Whole new attitude. So. Um, as we push forward now into the final round, the dreaded round, the freestyle round, which again is extra long uh, in, in these editions, uh, let's just recap the scores. So Osmond's at five, Will's at two, Barry's at one. So, you know, it seems to be a little bit of a runaway, but again, this round changes everything. So again, just to explain, guys, I am going to give you um, a set of puns and shout out. Fastest first, who can come up with, right? You've got 10 seconds. I'm also not going to give an example, so I'm just going to give the categories and then go. So what can you come up with, please? This is the beginning of round one, uh, round three, question one. Still getting the hang of it myself. Um, famous sitcom characters and the five senses. Yep. Ripping viewing. Okay, no one got anything there. That's fine. Uh, what can you do for U.S. states and breakfast food? Oh. Everyone's screaming along at home, I'm sure. No, okay, we'll just move on then. Don't worry. Uh, okay, Sorry. so this, this is the fourth one. Um, weapons and TV channels. Any combative object, anything you'd uh, make the clicker at. Nope. Wow. This is this is a new standard of gameplay. And our, our... Snife. Oh, I got How one. I got one. Hello. Yeah. Hello. I got I got one. Yeah. Netflix knife. Netflix knife. <laughs> okay. Okay. Well. Yeah. Right. Right. Right at the death. Why not? We'll give it. Uh. So Barry gets the point there. And our final one is Leonardo DiCaprio films and footballers. <laughs> <laughs> Catch me if you can tonight. Catch me oh, catch up. Why yes, not? Why not? Man. He's pulling it back. He's pulling it back. So uh, <laughs> that then uh, that then brings us to the end of the of the game itself. And Osman, congratulations with six impressive victory. Thank you very much.
No, it was uh, feels, feels 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 good. <laughs> no, yeah, it was it was hard one. It was it was an ugly war, but you know you you, Very you came out on top regardless. Um, and Will with free. I feel like these categories gave you a little bit of trouble, but you, you tried. Uh, I did. Uh, I was happy with Thomas party and bullshit. I'm just glad no one stole that off me. So, <laughs> but yeah, um, I'll try and I'll try and last for the full round three on the next go. <laughs> That's a promise. That's a promise right there. And uh, and and Barry, two points. I think we both know you could have done better, right? Uh, I, I thought my puns were uh, high quality. I just was uh, prejudiced against because I'm Scottish, I think. <laughs> well, luckily, <laughs> with this new dangfangled edition of Punnit, we do account for prejudice because yeah. we do do a second episode straight after. <laughs> so if you guys can't get enough of Punnit and you want to see these guys again, then you can go support us on Patreon and get access to the episode right now. And if not, just subscribe to the channel. Uh, find us on iTunes, Spotify, wherever, and we'll be there. Go back through the whole Punnet archive. Get in touch with me as well, the pun podcast at gmail.com. If you want to come on and be a contestant like these three, just get in touch. I'll let you know a day. I'll send you some sets of categories and we'll, you know, we get to work. So, um, yeah. And finally, Patreon, of course, is there as well. I already reminded you of that, but let me remind you again. So, um, yeah, we'll be back next week for another episode of Punnet. But until then, bye. <laughs>